The judge casework items are distributed to the magistrate who has the fewest work items allocated. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on resource patterns in YAWL. Today we talk about shortest queue, the ability to allocate a work item to a selected resource chosen from a group of eligible resources on the basis of having the shortest work queue. You can see the behavior in the following flash animation. Short skew. So uh, we start the animation and we have a judge case work item and this is allocated to the magistrate who has the shortest queue and it is Alicia because the other ones have each one work item here and she doesn't have any so she receives this and then completes it. In YAWL we can implement this by choosing the shortest queue allocation strategy. Okay, here we have uh, the admin on the top left, uh, on the right we have the YAWL editor and at the bottom Sean, Alicia and Nathan. And um, let's look at the admin work list. So um, there is already one case started and the first one has been allocated to Sean. And now um, if we start the next case we would expect by shortest queue that this is allocated either to Alicia or Nathan. So we start a case and then we can see it is allocated to Alicia and we start another case. Now it's allocated to Nathan and then we start another case. Now this is allocated to Sean. Another one Alicia, yet another one, then we have Nathan and so on and so forth. So this is definitely shortest queue. Um, let's see what happens if we now complete the work items here. Um, so we have this situation now, we have 3, 3 and 0, we start another case and then it goes here. So this works perfectly. This works very well. Thank you for watching.